Hi, I'm Matt Anzardo with Interlock Shot Finishes, and we're here today at Brewer Saconic Marina here in Portsmouth, Rhode Island. And today we're going to be conducting the fiberglass bottom coat NT challenge. Before we talk about the challenge, let's talk about the new product. Fiberglass bottom coat new technology, or NT, utilizes the latest in anti-fouling technology. By formulating a product using two premier resins, our dual resin technology, we're able to provide the benefits of a traditional hard paint along with the added benefits of an ablative paint. So what are those benefits? Those benefits are a slow polishing rate for optimal performance. It also has a durable, smooth surface optimizing speed. A super fast resin, which allows you to paint and launch the same day. A smart copper release system with all the performance without the excess copper. And it has a reduction in paint buildup over time. Fiberglass Bottom Coat NT offers all these benefits and comes in multiple colors and sizes, all at a great price. What is the Fiberglass Bottom Coat NT Challenge? Well, it's a way to show how, during application, that the Fiberglass Bottom Coat NT will actually go further than the leading competitor product, which we'll be calling Product X. Now I'm joined with Dave Rodericks, and he's the yard manager here at Brewer Saconic, and he and his crew are going to help us paint this boat with uh, doing the NT Challenge. And so, Dave, can you tell us a little bit about the boat? So what we have is a Wellcraft uh, V20 step lift. It's 20 feet long. Typically should use probably two or three coat, uh, quarts of paint, but we'll see what happens. Okay. Twenty-four. So what we're doing with the NT Challenge is we're going to split the boat down the center line and on the port side we're going to be painting the fiberglass bottom coat NT and on the starboard side we're going to be painting with the product X. See which one goes further. And we're going to be using the same rollers, a 3 8 snap roller for both applications. What I'm doing now is checking the film build on this. And we're getting about five to six mils wet, which is about where we want it recommended. Generally, we recommend about four or so. Go a little lighter if you wanted to. New technology. And he's putting it on four mils wet still. Still putting on at four mils. Really? Yeah. Huh. Wait, I want to try this. That's the front end. Okay, let me try this. It's still four mils. Right. Yeah, because I think all we need is one more ounce, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. yeah no. I, probably could have, I probably could have finished it off. All right, what we've got now is we painted the uh, port side with the fiberglass bottom coat NT and it took 25 ounces to paint the boat. So now we're going to use product X and paint the starboard side. X. This is brand X and what we're going to do is we're going to mix it up, we're going to pour out 25 ounces and we're going to be painting the starboard side with this and see how far this goes. Well, he's starting that with the NT. 
is already dry to the touch. It's about a half hour since we painted this section. Same rollers, a 3 8 snap roller for both applications. We're going to check the film build under here as well. And what we're seeing is uh, four mils wet. Dave is still putting it on in about four to five mils, which is probably, uh, again, per manufacturer recommendations. But he's all out of paint at this point in time. So what we have here is that the uh, fiberglass bottom coat, 25 ounces, painted the entire side where the product X left about a third of the boat unpainted. So what we've done is we've, we obviously have more boat to paint, so we had to get some more paint. So um, we're going to add another 7 ounces, so that will be a total of 32 ounces for this side versus 25 on the fiberglass bottom coat NT. So we've added another seven ounces to the, uh, to the tray here to finish up painting up the uh, starboard side with product X. So it was a total of 32 ounces that we're going to be using for the starboard side with product X and 25 ounces for the fiberglass bottom coat NT. So Dave, what does this mean for you? Well, from an applicator's point of view, it's going to be savings, obviously, material-wise for mm -hmm. our customer. Uh, the fact that we can launch the boat the same day that we paint it is also a substantial goal for us as far as saving time and, and getting our customers boats in the water. So what we found now with the fiberglass bottom coat NT challenge is that the fiberglass bottom coat NT took 25 ounces to paint the port side of this 20 foot well craft and of product X it took 32 ounces still wet as well. The fiberglass bottom coat NT gives you 20 percent more product in that can than product X. So it gives you better performance, it goes further, and you're able to paint and launch the same day. More time to go boating, all at a great price. I'd like to say thanks to Dave and his guys here at Brewer Saconic Marina. And if you'd like to more information about fiberglass bottom coat NT or other Interlux products, please go to our website at yachtpaint.com. And remember, your bottom leads the way, so make sure it's Interlux on your boat. Thank you, and have a great day.